One, city buses and cars will run on empty. In five years, city buses, car fleets, and even garbage trucks will begin to transition to electric-powered engines. Electric vehicles will begin traveling 300 to 500 miles on a single charge. And as smart grids in cities become more common, cars will be able to charge in public places and will begin to draw more on renewable energy sources. Two, cities will be healthier than ever. City health officials will have tools to prevent the rapid spread of disease as soon as or even before they show signs of breaking out. Officials will turn to mathematics and software to analyze patterns and trends so they can accurately detect emerging diseases. They'll have that data to know exactly where, when, and how to apply the city's medical resources to slow the spread of disease. 3. Smarter systems will quench cities' thirst and save energy. Cities will use technology to cut down on water waste by up to 50%. Sensors embedded throughout the city's entire water system, from treatment facilities to supply pipes, will provide real-time data to officials about water quality, energy usage, leakage, and waste. And when storms hit, city water systems will no longer be overwhelmed. Instead of spilling sewage into oceans and waterways, water will be purified and recycled back into the city's water systems. Four. City buildings will sense and respond like living organisms. As cities grow smarter, so will buildings. Technology will allow buildings to sense and respond to conditions like living organisms, protecting occupants, saving resources, and reducing carbon emissions. Thousands of sensors inside buildings will monitor everything from motion and temperature to humidity, occupancy, and light. This will enable repairs before something breaks, and emergency response units will be able to respond quickly with the necessary resources. Business owners and consumers will accurately manage their energy consumption and take action to reduce it. Five, cities will respond to a crisis even before receiving the emergency phone call. Cities will implement predictive policing solutions using pattern recognition of crime data to make sense of millions of historic incident, offense, and arrest records. This will give law enforcement the right information at the right time, even before a crime may have been committed, to head off spikes in criminal activity. Likewise, fire departments will begin gathering and analyzing real-time data from fire inspections, site and building structures, historical data, and even weather patterns to prevent fires and protect first responders when a fire occurs.